have had quite a cool spell before that and then suddenly it shoots up to 17 degrees and it feels relatively pleasant. But I'll tell you what, let's just stop that conversation now because we'll go round in circles and uh, it is a subjective matter. So let's talk about absolutes here. 16 degrees today, that is above the average for the time of the year in the south of the country. Take it how you like it. And if the sunshine comes out, it's going to feel pleasant. But where the fog lingers today, um, it is going to feel um, pretty chilly. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Anyway, hope you're getting the point this uh, today in the forecast. Anyway, it's going to be pretty chilly in the morning across the north of the country. It might be a touch of frost early in the night. But tomorrow, we'll see cloud and rain moving into the UK. Uh, it is going to be a more overcast sort of day. And now here's the interesting thing. Tomorrow, the temperatures are still going to be probably a little above the average for the time of the year. But because there's going to be a lot of cloud around in places, because there's going to be some rain around, it's probably not going to feel all that warm, if you know what I mean. So yes, 13, 14, 15 degrees here, for example, around East Anglia and Lincolnshire, but with cloud and bits and pieces of rain, it doesn't feel that great. Now, what is the weather map telling us for next week? Well, the winds are continuing, just to get a sense of the wind, they're continuing to come in from the south, um, and that does mean that those temperatures will stay on the milder side. So certainly, look at that, this is what Nago was referring to earlier on, it could hit 17 degrees, but look at that, if it stays cloudy and, say, dreary, it ain't going to feel that good. If the sun comes out and it's 17 degrees, it's going to feel so much better. So it really all does depend on many more factors um, the weather than the, or how it feels than just that number, just the thermometer uh, on its own. But you can see it's a bit of a mixed bag actually over the next few days. If you missed points in our forecast, there'll be a full forecast coming up again without this discussion uh, in about uh, half an hour. No, then we'll have to.